All right, today is the day. I'm about to leave. I promised you guys I would go get the Ford Focus since I got a garage now. And I would bring it over here in order to start working on it and stuff. So let's go get it. Yep, we're here. Old Travis brought the old big dogs out. But we're here to pick this thing up and take it home and resurrect it. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> it's uh, three flat tires. The transmission was uh, empty, but I filled it up. Dylan said it was slipping, but I don't remember it slipping when it got hot because the transmission cooler is obviously gone now. And then you got the old Miata cart sitting here with the uh, the door on top of it that I ran through with that car is just sitting on top of this. Dylan's actually selling this place. That's why I'm having to come and get my stuff <laughs> finally. So I don't know what to do with this. Um, I have no idea. We were going to put like a carburetor 350 in it and work out the details there, but we're not totally sure what to do with that now. So it may just go to the junkyard. <laughs> Show me in the comments if you want me to put it into the junkyard or if we just, just start from scratch and build a new one. Thank you, Travis, for hauling my junk. <laughs> you, got, you guys all know Travis. I bought a Jeep from him a long time ago. And, uh, yeah, he, he wanted to uh, haul this thing. Unfortunately, I have to get it out of here because Dylan doesn't want it here anymore. <laughs> so we're going to air up these tires and see if this thing rolls around. Yeah! She's been sitting for like a, a little over a year, I think. She started right up. Don't mind that starter fluid sitting there. Right, we got the car in the garage finally got the car home uh the tires are flat they were aired up they're just not holding air the beads aren't holding air very well um so the plans for this at the moment is going to be fix the wheel stance a little better front and back i'm gonna finish cutting out this rear because i stopped doing it on both sides i thought about getting some fender flares to bring out some you know give it a little more stance or whatever Tune up, oil change, because it needs it. Um, some much needed maintenance, you know, obviously. I'm gonna put some lights on it and I'm gonna paint it. I'm gonna paint it before I put the lights on it. Uh, LED lights, 
I'm gonna fix these headlights because they don't work and I'm buying new tail lights for the rear because they are busted. I don't think if you guys have seen this. Yeah, they're busted. So fixing that. But yeah, see, that's where I kind of stopped messing with all that, but I will eventually get it fixed. But it is home. It's ready to be worked on. So expect some cool content from this. I'm gonna do some lives with it. I'm gonna do, you know, videos obviously. And yeah, look, that sticker is still on there after, you know, five, six years. Sean Wayne, yeah. And the, the inside is very nasty. Uh, not, I mean, not nasty, but uh, it's not clean. That's for sure. <laughs> God. There's mud, it stinks. And then there's why it's tag. It says U18, yes. <laughs> uh, the inside's gonna, the inside definitely gonna need clean. So I may make a, uh, like a standalone video of detailing the inside. I think that would be really cool. So yeah, um, paint, wheel stance, fixing all this, tail lights, headlights. There's a lot to do. So expect some content. Hello, Mustang. Good, good Mustang. Don't forget to subscribe and tell your friends, share all that good stuff. And yeah, this thing's gonna be a really cool build.